You're now tuned in to Hot Topics with Lady Charmaine, and I'm your host, Lady Charmaine, and we have another great show for you tonight. So right now, take this moment to tag and share and tell all your friends to tune in, because we're talking about relationships, 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 and we want you guys to give us a call at 916-226-9226 to share in all the hot conversation, and I'm going to let you know who I got in the studio. I got special guests in the studio with me, but I'm going to tell you who that is coming up right after this. Back at Hot Topics with Lady Charmaine. And again, like I said, I want you guys to like, share, and tag your friends. And here's the number to call in. It's 916-226-9226. And I got some special people that I want to share with y'all that's in the studio. Help me welcome to the studio my husband, Joe Bassett. Hey, baby. Joe. Hey, hey, how's it going, everybody? That's him. And of course, we've got my girl, Miss Marie Hutchison. Hey. Marie. And we also have the Derek Dennis, the hair hustler. Up, yeah. yes. And then we have our very <laughs> special guest in the studio. He goes by the name of Mr. Ozzy McNaz. Ozzy. He is comedian yes, extraordinaire. Thank you. It's good to be here. Woo! The crowd goes wild. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Joe. So, Ozzy, you are, you are a comedian straight out of Philadelphia. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and I want to just talk to Isaac a little bit about, you know, just his upbringing and who he is and what he does. Because I know he do a couple of shows here in uh, the Northern California area. Yes, so I, I want do. you to tell us a little bit about what it is that you do. Well, what I do, pretty much, I, I get on stage, make people laugh like they pay me to do. <laughs> no, no, no. no. But you can, uh, you can find me uh, pretty much any at any comedy club if I'm in your town. Um, I, I do... Laughs Unlimited, I've done Improv, man, uh, Punchline, you name it, I've been there. I've been doing stand-up for almost 10 years, so wow. it's pretty much what I, I always wanted to do it as a kid, you know, it's my, it's my passion. So what's know. the source of your jokes? Honestly, it your depends. Your family, kids? I talk about everything, relationships, mm -hmm. family, you know. Uh, women with big hands that scare me. Okay. Wow. That's a cat. Wow. Check. Hey. Wow. She looked like Beyonce, but she got hands like LeBron. Ryan. She got them Shaq hands. I ain't playing her one on one. Uncle Drew, get your hand off my shoulder. She's got to go. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Just pause. Now, I do have this question for you because this is, this is one of my pet peeves. Though. I, I love to see comedians and I love to laugh. But why do comedians want to talk about their sexual exploits in their bedrooms as mm. if we find what they do in their bedroom humorous? Well, it depends on the comedian and also depends on the crowd. Mm -hmm. Because certain comedians know their crowd and certain crowds don't go for that. Certain crowds want to hear family jokes. Mm -hmm. Like when Kevin Hart gets on stage, he talks a lot about his family. Mm -hmm. That's his crowd. And he plays. I mean, he can talk about his sexual activities, mm -hmm. but he knows his crowd. You know, that's just an example. You know, it just depends on the crowd and it depends on the comedian. Okay, okay. Now, I, I performed around a lot of, you know, people who wanted to hear some down and dirty stuff. Mm -hmm. Really? Just being in the beginning, <laughs> yeah. yeah, I was like, y'all want to hear me talk like that? No. My mama here. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Nasty the better for yeah. some. Yeah. Yeah. Family here, yeah. like I can't but, do it. <laughs> I'm good. Sometimes, you know, some some people want to hear about you know relationships and dating women with kids and you know mm -hmm. and they baby kids and everything else. Baby kids, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I got a baby kid story, like you know. Do you have kids? I don't have kids. Okay. To be honest with you. Well, I, 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 I wrap it up so all my kids get kidnapped. Just tossed away. Shut up. Well, tonight we will be talking about uh, some really. Uh, <laughs> some really roll on. <laughs> relationship <laughs> stories. <laughs> now, I'm going to read this one to you guys. Uh, which, um, I think it's kind of interesting. This one was sent to me, and I want to get your thoughts about this one. It says. Um, this one was posted on Facebook. It was sent to me and it says, so they said, I need your thoughts. I just left the family dollar store and I was standing in a line, a long line behind a pretty lady. Let's say mid early thirties. 
hair laid, nice outfit, and dope shoes. We start talking and eventually exchange info. She gets to the register and she whips out an EBT card. Uh, I'm instantly turned off. She leaves and then I pay for my items. As I walk out, she waves to me as she drives away in a newer model BMW. Okay, so I'm on the fence about hitting her up. It's not because she has a food stamp card. He said, I'm legit trying to figure out why she has one. If her hair is laid, expensive clothes, and pushing a clean whip, I get the feeling she's getting over on the system. At this age, it just isn't attractive to me. So would you date a person on some sort of government assistance program that portrays that they are well off but not? Or, or a very well made and, or are they just getting over on this system? Ooh. Ooh. At, See, I like this topic. Yeah, this is good. I'm saying mm-hmm. I'm single. Now I'm I'm be honest with you. If I see a woman in in a, in a grocery store at a market and she pulls out an EBT card, my first thought is not, oh, she's trying to get over on the system. Because what if she really needs it? Mm. You know, we all can't be rich. You know, we all True. can find great jobs. Mm-hmm. You know, some of us are just less fortunate. True. Mm-hmm. Now, her appearance. Now, sometimes your appearance can make a difference. Like this one time, I seen this girl in my store and I thought she was real cute. Then I looked down and she had on some brand new Jordan flip flops with some dirty socks. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I can't. I, I'm not gonna be able to do it. That's a no no. I said no. I don't care. Socks is telling the truth. I don't care how good she make potato salad or sock dirty. She got on some brand new Jordan flip flops. Yeah, something's wrong. <laughs> I mean, her bathroom dirty then. Her bathroom. <laughs> That'd be her. Oh, be her. That'd be her. <laughs> socks aren't that expensive. You can you can spray for some dirt. Right, right. She, right. Let's Let's go, use your go go deeper. Let's her go size is deeper. Dirty. You walk around the house. Her with size looks like she was moonwalking in the oil spill. Her, her, <laughs> That's bad. Her flip flops was brand new. They look like they was tattooed to her feet. Them socks. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I can't. Uh, uh, I can't uh, do you it. You need to stop. But you know what? I had a friend. I had a friend. Now this is in the of maybe her I don't know because mm. I had a friend who knew how to make it happen okay. on nothing mm. she knew how to be fly and pull them wigs back make it look like she's a brand new weave Check. you know she knew how to, to to go budget shopping to the fullest you know hit them get them had to hook up with the fake uh, Gucci's but if you stand mm. far enough away oh, okay. it's Gucci to you but mm. you know it'd be somebody mm. else's okay. Gucci or something yeah. but she knew yes. how to present herself on a budget and the people thought she always had money because she knew how to just she to make it happen, budget. stretch her makeup, you know what I'm saying, and all that kind of stuff, make it happen. So in defense of old girl, you know, well, if she, I don't know, brand names, mm, changes the story a little bit because uh-huh. you got it. Yeah, I don't know. But see, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't necessarily dismiss her for being at the dollar store and having her stuff together unless I would know her. If you, if if she sparked interest in the conversation, then maybe you get to know her. And if you see that there's a lot of other stuff going on outside of your first initial impression, because some people their appearance is all they have, yeah. mm, and so if they're not feeling true. good about themselves, then everything They'll else is going to go, it's going to go all downhill. You so if she's, if she's, she's taking care of herself, now the car. That puts it over the top a little yeah. bit because cars are expensive. Yeah. Cars I mean, so, so I mean, there could be a story behind that. Yeah. Who knows? But uh, I, I would get to know her a little more. But if she's if she's like that in every aspect of her life, that's not somebody I want to want to necessarily you know be yeah, with. But no I mean, you don't you know, know her. The first impression could first impression could be you know it, it's she a little over the top or doing whatever. But you never know because some yeah. people spend a lot of money on personal because yeah. that's all they that's really a, they want to feel good, good about point. themselves even, even you know a homeless or you don't have a job you want to be able to get a good haircut and I put a nice pair of shoes and you know makes you feel good so yeah. that could be the that could be the situation think, so how much is too much to be spending because if she's on public assistance now it could be now we could be judging it could be some things that she had purchased before she was on public assistance and so she just already has some nice clothes and nice clothes but if you're on public assistance don't they ask you like if you have a car and how much your car is and different things like that Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and if you make a certain amount they won't they won't give you that Mm -hmm. what if it's not her car 
It was a Good gift question. or something. Yeah. She yeah. Ro- rolling, rolling somebody else. True. Yeah, that, 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 that's true, too. Now, now, if you've been out there in public as- assistance and you know you use cheating the system, give us a call. 912 <laughs> 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 Keep it 100. Six. Don't say your name. I got a friend <laughs> you know, that... Uh, <laughs> who's me? Y'all, I, I knew a young lady. For a friend. <laughs> she, um, now, y'all got to pardon me if I sound like I'm slurring. My headache is coming back. I had a headache, y'all, so y'all got to pardon me. So, it's yeah. coming back. Because <laughs> I don't want people to think, why is she sounding like that right now? But um, anyway, she what she did was she would use somebody else's social security number mm. to work under so she wouldn't lose her um, mm. her welfare benefits. That's a dangerous game. Yes, Scam money. Yeah. Wow. That's jail time. And, you know, absolutely. Wow. So, yeah. you know, if, if you've done that, don't say your name. Give us a call. 916 <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, just oh, call and dry snitch. <laughs> okay, exactly. How <laughs> <laughs> do you know Test somebody that's time. done that? There's a lot of new rules with getting in the system now, so you can't just slide in there like you used to be able to mm-hmm. back in the day. Hide right. your property and all that kind of stuff. They they ask different yeah. kind of questions now. They you know they stop people having a bunch of children. You can't get pregnant. Wait two years and you pregnant again. They got a hold on that now. Mm. <laughs> oh, they got really? a hold on okay. that. Okay. So no, if you really. have if you have okay. a baby, and you have a two year old, say you have a three year old, you have a baby, get scissors for that baby. Baby gets maybe two. You get pregnant again. That second child has to be five. Wow! Wow! Before you get any assistance for that new baby. Wow! They had to put rules on it. Because the women were using that system. Oh, yeah. Having babies to I stay in the system. That's a shame. Yeah. Wow. So they had to fix it. Right, right. Okay. Well, I, I, I know I've seen too many, you know, you, when you see those expensive cars in the projects, make you wonder. Back, okay, wait a minute. Somebody they got, got a Range up. Rover up in here looking, yeah, looking brand new. Rims. I mean, got the rims, got the beat and everything. Yeah. But yeah, yeah y'all all up in this. I mean, that you know, that, that, yeah. that right there makes, makes you question. Did you want to put that energy into getting you a place, a roof over your head that was quali- high quality opposed to a car that was high quality? But maybe, yeah. you know, they way of thinking was different. Okay, if something go bad, I could sleep in this car, this nice car, and be having the air and this and that, the warm seats. Who knows how people think? But you know, socialization is a big deal because if you've never been taught a budget or how to deal yeah, with your money and do that kind of stuff, you, you're not going to know so what lame. you're supposed to be doing and then you get to a point where you don't care. That's what they right. need to be teaching in school instead of all these economics yeah, and one plus. That's the, we don't use that. Yeah, teach how to be a pay, sure bill pay and stuff. Sure you sure know? don't use that as in the real world. Right. Yeah. Yeah. No. What about emotions and how to talk to people and how to get out of social media and just live and look at people in their eye. You know, mm. you know like... Okay, so you well, I'm glad you said that. that. I'm, 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 gl- I'm glad you said yeah. that, Derek. That's good. Because here is a question. You know, dudes see beautiful women all the time on social media, right? And you may yes. not ne- never see them in person. So how do you shoot your best shot in the DMs? Because a lot of women complain about men approaching them in the DMs, but the gentleman said, well, I may not ever see you in person, so how do I shoot my best shot in the DMs? <sighs> Brothers and, and ladies, Marie, you're a single woman. How would you? How would, <laughs> sorry, how would you want a man to shoot his best shot he, in the deal? Oh my god! Oh my god! Uh, you know, I always get, I, believe it or not, I always get hit up in my DMs. So there is a pattern that the brothers use when they hit you in a DM. Mm. What's the pattern? You are so pretty. I just want oh, to. Yeah, I just want to let you know that you're beautiful. You know, maybe I get to know you. Tell me about yourself. You know, they'll start like that. Yeah, that's pretty okay. much what I say. Okay, huh? that's how they'll, <laughs> that's how they'll start. <laughs> yeah. And yeah. then, but with, but with that template, <laughs> then that's where, for me, I'm just speaking for me. You said template. That's what, it's a template. Because <laughs> they, they all use it. They go right to it. It's a script. Uh, and they use uh, it. Like but it. Then, then after that little script, then that's when you start listening. Because it's going to either go left or right. Mm. And for me, it always goes left. Right. Mm. I always get the crazies. So uh, when people find love on the internet, I'll be like amazed. It amazes me because I get it, they crazy in the DMs. You know, it, it. I don't know. So how do you shoot your shot? Good question. Because the shots that I get shot in my DMs are all inappropriate mm. at all so times. So Ivy, tell us, how do you shoot your shot in the DMs? How do it go I'll down? I'll be honest with you. Yeah, I start honesty. off by just saying, hey. hey. Just, just that just three hey? letters? Just, just hey. Because then she's going to respond, hey, do I know you? I know she going to, a lot of them are going to, it's a natural response. Do I know you? And see me, hey is for horses. <laughs> right. <Yeah. laughs> right. Some girl said that to me. Yeah. One time. And I was like, you trying to be funny? No. Yeah, no. Right. Because <laughs> you know, it's so funny. Although funny. I'm, although I am married and it's all over my social, I'm married. My husband, pictures, and I still get people to say, hey. Yeah. And I, of course, I don't reply because it's just irritating. Hey or hi. 
And the I'm like, hay is so full. It's a hay that's full of a lot of stuff. Yeah. And it's I don't hay back. Hay. I don't a, hide back. Hay. What can I get? What's going to happen? Because with me, you have yeah. to, what is it that you want? Exactly. Speak in a sentence. That's right. And stop poking. What is a poke? <laughs> like, don't, don't be poking, poking me. Right. What, poke. is that? Uh, what is that? I'm what glad that they, they, they got the wave button there because I just wave. Oh, yeah, they do. That's yeah, what they I, I wave, wave right there. Yeah. That's the thing about me. Me, I don't really like to send. I get lots of waves. I don't wave back. I don't get that either. Honestly, I'm more of an in-person type of person. I yeah. like to meet yeah. girls in person. Mm -hmm. Okay. I don't know. So you know, what if you see a girl on social media and you want to meet him in person? Mm -hmm. What do you say? There you go. You know, I'll spark up a conversation and say, you know what? Would it be all right if we you know, met up for lunch or met for a cup of coffee? I'm okay. like that. Right. It's not just I'm like, oh, yeah, well, I'm trying to meet. I'm trying to smash. <laughs> 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 just stand in third. But even before you get to that, wouldn't you have to have a conversation? Yeah. Wouldn't it have to be a little time? Yes. Of How course. long would that be for you? Right. The conversation would have to be at least three minutes before I ask for it. <laughs> yeah. That part. Wow. Okay. Okay, y'all. I'm be somebody wow. had posted on social That's media, good. and I saw this, and I thought this was a really good question. And the gentleman said, "Ladies, if a man was straightforward and told him and told you that all he wanted was sex." How would the conversation go? Because you know how women always say, the only thing a man wants is sex. He said, and a lot of times they do. So if the man just yeah. straight up told you from the beginning, all I want is sex, what would be your reaction? Sure. I thought that was real interesting. Well, you okay, can't. single lady. Yeah, yeah. What would you? Yeah, what I got it. My reaction be, y'all sure y'all want to hear my reaction? It needs to be a straight up real and honest. If a dude comes, came to me and was like, hey, you know, I was looking at you. I think you're pretty. You know, I'm just trying to. Depending on how he bring it, you know, I'm trying to mm -hmm. be with you for whatever. Let's hook up. You know, I'm trying to holler at you. That right there, <laughs> that right there tells me. <laughs> she has to be in the mood. She needs to see what kind of mood she's going to be in. What was that, Marie? That was a pregnant pause for real. I made a good point. I made a point. Depends if the Henny is in the picture. Okay. But, but you know what? And that's a good that's a good question, Lady Charmaine, because we, we talk about we want the truth, but you can't handle the truth. <laughs> right. Yeah. You can't exactly. handle it right. because the first thing a woman would do, even though she might want it, is get offended. Right. right. How you just going to get at me like that? Call me more. Well, I think mm -hmm. it's just the way that you do it. If you say, look, you oh, know, it's a big way I'm, that you feeling, do it. I'm feeling you so much, but. All I, all, I'm out here and I'm not into being in a relationship. I'm not going to tie myself down to nobody. So we're both adults, right? So what's up? Uh, can we get intimate? I want to be intimate with you. I love this. I love your eyes. I love whatever physical attribute that you're attracted her. to. It's, it happens. And, and it be, just happens. And be honey, and, and say, like, if you say no, that's cool. But this is the type of person that I am. And you can take it or leave it. And I'll be on my way. Yeah, but true. I do, you know, we're, we're dealing with each other. So true. it's okay that's to get an real. answer, yes or no. That's you know, let's be realists. We're adults. We're not teenagers or nothing like that. And if she get attitude, then that's your problem. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Or and then you could come to me and say, you know what, I'm a Christian woman. I'm not doing that right now. I'm looking for a husband, and then you would shut me down. Well, that's okay? that's my thing. That's lately. fine. That's, that's been yeah. my thing. Mm. Yeah. I've been yeah. shutting you gotta, down you just gotta like that. that. You gotta yeah, you right. got to respect yeah, you that. You got to respect all that. day. And I kind of question myself because when I get the haze, I'll be like, look, I'm just gonna tell you right now. Mm -hmm. Don't get. I go straight into yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's how wow. I've been getting my DMs lately. I ain't got no time. Don't be getting at me if you don't let the Lord blah blah. Be like, hey, hey, I was just. But like, I'm good, I'm good. And I'm going to tell y'all right now, I don't know if a lot of men know this, but uh, I know that a lot of men getting this. And lately, for the last years, it's been some prostitutes that's on Facebook. And you know they're prostitutes because they're all different nationalities. And they'll, mm. they'll try to uh, hook you. And it's maybe, you know, I swear like 10 of them I could show you. And they'll mm. say, hi, um, such and such, I want a friend. You know, friend me, and I'll make all your dreams come true mm. and stuff like that. Mm. And I know a lot of men get that because I'm not the only one that's getting that. I, and I actually messaged one of them back like, look, I know I'm not the best see. looking dude. <laughs> <laughs> see, but, I, see. but I know I'm cute enough not to pay for this. Like, Exactly. Don't, call me, don't do this no more, Kevin. <laughs> <It's> I'm blocked <laughs> You know what? They show up. They show up in junk mail a lot. Yeah, if exactly. you go in your junk mail, you got all kind of haze and oh, all kind of like... scams up in there. I'm glad they don't come to my regular mail. Right. It'd be all up in it's the junk mail. I don't understand It'd be that. All up in there. But you know what? The the game has changed now. Yeah, now people really go. Has. You want somebody? You go into your the, your device instead of going uh, paroling on the street on the corner. Street? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because it's cold out there. Yeah, you ain't lying. <laughs> No more hooking on the street. I ain't getting nothing for nobody. <laughs> so they got savvy with it. Up and, 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 and,
Yeah, that's yeah, a that's true. True. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because so online you can't see that man's hands and feet. You can't see his shoes. You don't yeah. know what he's working with. Exactly. I'm saying, that, but women don't like guys that play games. Yeah. I don't right. know. I don't That's know. True. I don't know women like guys that play games at all. Yeah. But when you come at them like that, like Derek was talking about, how straight and just bold. <laughs> that, that, that that's that. You can either take it or I'll leave it. it. I mean, you got to respect that. It's like, hey, you know, if you're a woman, if if you if you get a yes, you get a yes. Yeah. But that's that's shooting your shot for real. Yeah. You gonna be about you might be about ten, fifteen percent. No, no, no. no. <laughs> you don't think so? That. You think it's higher? With what you just said, if you was a single man, just shot your DM to the moon. <laughs> for real? Yes. I, that's just me. That's how much I I would be keeping with it because we don't have no time what to wait. Success rate? You think you would have with that? Because you know why? Because you know why? <laughs> Because the way people are functioning right now in relationships, nobody wants to really be in one. Everybody's mm. tipping and tasting. Uh. And everybody's got their they, they best five list. So so give wow. me his, his his speech? Yeah. What percent would that be? Would that be a 30% success rate with that with that line? Pretty high. Right now, 30, you 35? Like, you like the Bill Clinton of players no, right I'm now. Not, I'm not even <laughs> is it, is it, is it 50%? Gonna, you know, I've been married, man. Is, is it 50, so I don't 50? Know. I'm just so. being me. Wow. You, know, you ain't lose. You still got it. Just saying. So, you still I'm got it. Real. What Derek just said, what Derek just said, a lot of women, if he still wasn't got, married, I mean, with, so, ooh, I can't I can't believe that, that what he just said would get a, that's a 50 yes. 50 shot. It because was, I mean, can that's. Can I be real? Can I be real? Yeah, can be, be real. Please, be real. Please. I want to know what you just said to a cra- to a woman, to a crazy woman who's interested in that. What you just said was sexy. Mm. What you just said was so straight up. It was sexy. What you just said was full of passion, and it was sexy. Wow! You just turned on a bunch of women because okay. it was so real, and then it's, they have an attachment to it. <laughs> I ain't got to attach to you either, so which makes me like you even more. So I'm going to be crazy when you try to, to separate yourself from now, me. Now, would she say yes or no in that? How the percentage wow. level would be what? The percentage is pretty high, man. Mm-hmm. Wow. I'm I mean, something else. I'm out here. I'm in it. Now, now I'm keep in mind. Here. So that means that a lot of the people are fake then. They, they're, they're playing games and wasting time. Because why, why are you getting single people getting uh. and, and wasting time to try to... Uh, what is this? Like, we like it. lay it down on the table in the. But beginning. you don't want to appear like you, you're, you're, you're that girl, mm. right? You want to. You, 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 you may be crazy. that girl, but you don't want to put it out there that quick that you're that girl. Well, you ain't. This ain't no husband material, so ain't no future in him. So you better get your. <laughs> you don't want to seem too night. promiscuous. That's what it is. Oh that's, you don't yeah, want yeah. to be promiscuous. Yeah. Women are yeah. concerned about promiscuity these days. Who told you that? Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Some of the women that I tried okay, to. Okay, well, they're good. Well, okay, well, that's. Okay, see, see, I don't see know. you got. Wow. This, this, this leads me. I, I, I need to meet the girls that you be around. It depends on how you bring it. In. I'm telling you, we, we talk about wow. women that like thugs, women that like the, that, uh, that, 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 yeah. that, this behavior right here. That's what he just bought. This behavior right here. Look, I ain't trying to be with you. You pretty. Oh, Your eyes is pretty. I like what you rocking. Yeah. Let's go ahead and do this. Will I call you tomorrow? Probably not, but I'm just saying. getting it like y'all getting it right. I'm telling y'all. Wow. Y'all go to sleep on these women right it. now, man. They, wow. they, they, Kumande was on High Kumunda. He was on here one day. And he said he was scared. <laughs> what did he say? He was talking about scared because the women so strong and how they get at him. Do you guys like bold, forceful and he a women singer. that tell you exactly what it is that they want? I is like that the that. new I thing? I think that's eternal. Yeah, really. It's like I said me. earlier, as long as if she, as long as she don't got big hands, yeah. she can be as bold as she wants <laughs> or big ass that feet. That speech from a woman would would be good. For yeah, you. yeah, I would love that. Did y'all hear? Did y'all hear that? Did y'all just hear that? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, be honest with me. Yeah, look, eyes. Mm. Don't be acting like a church girl when you know that right. you, the last <laughs> month you was, you know, a club hopper and and, 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 and a bed hopper. Don't do that. That same energy is crossing But you know, the there is something there is something about just being real with how you feel it. Yes, but I mean, I absolutely. haven't been in that situation. I never dated anybody necessarily that was that aggressive. I always went for the quiet type. How I ended up with Charmaine was just God. I don't know. Yeah. She just, that just came God up. That's a God, God thing. God but, but Amen. you know, the, the I, I don't know how I would react somebody that came at me like that. Be honest. I don't know how I react. I'd be, be like, kind of, I'd be kind of like, okay, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Right, you like that. right, right. I may be able to get back it off because I'll be more concerned about why you so aggressive. But brother Joe, if you was in the moment and if all you was hiding, you was, you know, that would be like. You doing that if y'all at the dinner table and y'all in the public or whatever? Oh my God, she's really that. She must be a hoe. But if she, if she's, if you in the, you know, good night. I, you know, I, I giving the kiss at the door or something, then. I don't think you go. You know what I'm yeah. saying? She be like, Ooh, "Can I come in, Joe?" You know what I'm saying? I don't think that you're gonna be like, 
You know, oh wait a minute, she's too nasty. <laughs> See, I don't know. I think a little differently. I think who else has she been like that with? True. I, I true. just, I just I go there. That up. I, I go true. there. I'm like, I think, that's true. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of like Ozzy in the sense that I know I'm not the Denzel type of brother. So what, what the, you know, yeah. how many other brothers have you done? But this to her, you why? could be. What? Women have different preferences. They ain't got to be Shamar Moore or whoever. Like you know, true that. But I, I just that I go there. I go there with who else you talking to? Like, what, what you, what you might you have? Like, that's, that's true. That's I, I, I ain't lying. I, 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 I didn't even I think about that. There. Yeah, that's you true. Know, I, who was you doing? Girl, come here. Let me spare you, girl. <laughs> we we got on dirty socks. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we we do too. Who, who let me ra- raise my hand. We we think the same thing. See, it's a trip because it's a trip. How we can kind of? I'm not saying you guys doing it, but how we separate that thing just yeah. how you think how how you were saying how men mm-hmm. think about women like who you who you we <laughs> you know that's, ooh, that's the damage the, it is because the damage mm. is on both sides of the tree mm, if you got a absolutely. man that sleep with a bunch of women he has the same damage as a woman sleep with a bunch of men mm, it's so the good. same damage on each end of the absolutely. tree that's but for good. some strange reason the guy gets all the cool points when he does it and the girl just She's called up. Yeah. Mm. That's what you nasty too. Mm. That's that is sad. How about that? Mm. Let's be nasty together. How about just keep it real? <laughs> well, uh, I'm a, I'm a, I, well, bottom line is I, we said this the first time, one of the first shows we had a conversation, and I said as simple as this. Mm. The reason why it's so it's such a, a a separation is because a woman, when she lays down, she's giving herself to whatever man. She's laying out open her legs. Mm. So therefore, she's giving a piece. A man just going in and he taking it. That's why we don't a lot of time have an emotional connection. But when a woman lays down and she gives herself to somebody, it's like, you know, like, oh my God, that's sacred. And you're doing that. Like, and, and then he has a piece of you. You have you carrying a piece of uh, you in him nine times out of ten. Ooh. And I'm talking about sperm. Let's be Ooh, real. You're getting real deep. So, well, but but yeah. nine times ten, we're not carrying a piece of you guys with us, right? Okay, yeah. So it's we're, like we're it's, flowing, it's a psychology. Well, unless it's crabs. We flowing, <laughs> right. We're flowing back <laughs> into. See, you guys, oh, we gotta start talking about the see, body and stuff. We see. can get yeah, this but, one, but, y'all, but, right here. See, but see. See how, I got a piece of something. No, I see what you're saying, but the reality of that is what you're saying. This is where I disagree with what you're saying because the way God created it, right. Okay, yeah. if we talk about how God purpose of him creating it, you are being just emotionally affected, whether you feel like it's emotional sex or not, you're still being affected, you're still being connected, you're still making a weaving True. bond with True. that person, mm-hmm. just like a woman does with a man. Amen. There is That's no fine. separation of those emotions. It, just because you don't cry like I might cry all week over a nigga, you might, excuse my language, but you, you may not, but That's you still true. hurt. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. might go wash your car every day. That's how you're dealing with that. Yeah. Or you might go walk your dog. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just More aggressive on the basketball court. Right, exactly. So, so in my up. opinion, yeah. I just don't think the it, it it just looks different. Right. But the damage is the same. That's yeah. true. That's a good I point. I agree with that. I completely agree with it that. Is, um, I, now, you, you mentioned a point. It is emotional on both sides. That's good. I do feel, however, that sometimes the woman is a little more of course attached and emotional. We, yeah. than, so so that's, that. where, that's where I think the the damage where it, it it may go from one man to the next man to the next man where a man with the same amount of partners may not have that necessarily attachment yes. per se why is that i was just gonna why is that that go ahead. woman like she doesn't she can't like just say oh well it was just what it was mm. i could but us guys we can do it's easy for us to do that but yeah. most women that they, was easy they for me an attachment. yeah mm-hmm. why is it why is it? I think just just because uh, the the yeah. biology of a woman is I think it's just more more emotional, yeah. more nurturing, mm-hmm. more more giving, and, and and wanting to you know take care of, and not not to say she she's in either you know she's weak or anything. That's just uh, you need somebody nurturing. You need that, and That's they right. give that when they lay down, and and so a man receivers, receivers yeah. and a man yes. doesn't necessarily go in with that nurturing. I'm gonna take care of you. Now it, to to him it could be a game. It could be like, okay, I just want her be, to fulfill my desire. And once that's done, okay, I'm moving on. And so, I can just and, want him to yeah. fulfill my desire. And, and so, it, it, it can go both ways. It can go both ways. But more than likely, it's the woman that maybe wants more at the relationship, at least traditionally. Again, I've been out the scene for a while. So, but, but now, I, I, from what I hear from Marie, things have changed <laughs> and things okay. have, tables have been flipped. <laughs> and, you know, so he goes, but, but, I, but I still think there's an emotional component that a woman has. You are a soldier that's, in this war. Yeah, she's doing it. Men and women, you are a soldier. I gotta tell by the way you talk. I can't. Yeah. <laughs> Give it to me. Now get out. Get out. Here, wipe that off. Get out. Get out 
Maria, 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 how to get you? <laughs> See, and then I walk away. As you butt neck and crying on then your stomach. Yeah, walk yeah. Away. <laughs> Hi, you're live with Hot Talks with Lady Charmaine. What's your name? Where are you calling from? Walk away. Uh, this is Kalita. I'm calling. I'm calling from Sacramento. Hi, Kalita. What's your comment? <laughs> that I wanted to set. I wanted to tap in with what y'all talking about right now. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> She was about to say real Go ahead, Mama. <laughs> hey. Hey. I, we can hear you. I, I'm sorry. What? I'm trying to listen and look. Wow. Oh, you trying to watch it? Have turn down the radio. Or turn down the radio. You can turn it down in the background. Time, no, but I was just saying that it, it also needs to be factored in that a lot of times when women feel like they are... Um, they, they're dis, they're not attached because of the sexual experience. Mm -hmm. It's because of the sexual experience. Mm -hmm. They are not yep. about that part. So a woman could go man to man to man to man to man to man because a lot of men don't really know how to make her be like messed up over him. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Okay. And then it's the reciprocal. If he if he is the bomb dot com in that way only and no other way, she'll act like he's the best thing since sliced bread, the biggest gift ever. Oh, you know? Wow. Yeah. I believe Interesting. That. Yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I believe Th that. Thank you for sharing. I appreciate it. <laughs> 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 and thank okay. you for watching the show. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you have a good night. All right, you're welcome. Oh. Bye bye. <laughs> so let's talk about that. Yeah. That was good. Let's talk about that. That mm -hmm. was good. Right. Yeah, because see, Man, I ain't never thought about it like that because you ain't getting satisfied sexually, you know. So you're just yeah. moving on and you, you, just going on, moving, moving on, on up like George and Weezy. But then you hear a lot of men, a lot of women. I'm sorry, I, I hear it because I what I do in my profession, and they even though they make a joke, I hear it on talk shows. I hear it, and it's sad to me. I I see it on Judge shows. Mm -hmm. I see it on that new Vivica Fox show that, and a lot of women, literally, they'll accept the man. But then you'll stay with him, but then you'll downgrade his, his penis size or whatever. Yeah, because he got right. a small. And you're beating this man down in front of hundreds wow. of people. Or, right. and, wow. But you'll stand with him. You're, you're, you're still with him, but you're talking about, oh, he only lasts this long and he's small. And he, like, That's true, because I've had girls that have cheated with me yeah, on their I boyfriends. But I'm like, well, why you don't just be? Because I love him. But, I yeah. said, but you said he had a three. Th 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 <laughs> th oh my he's God. not satisfying. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, he, wow. he must be a good cook. You must. <laughs> <laughs> he know how to make them Belgian waffles. That's what. That's why you don't want to leave? Not, and you like love Belgian waffles. Give you a ride to work. <laughs> <laughs> and you love Belgian waffles. So yeah, yeah. Okay. Just, okay. with maple syrup. Barbecue sir. skills. <laughs> okay, now, okay. Somebody had sent this question in, and I wanted to know if you guys feel this question is true. And they wanted to know if you could turn a hoe, male or female, into a housewife. And should someone's promiscuous mm. past be held against them? Mm. What do you Oof. think? Because everyone has a past. I think you Deep can't breath. turn a hoe into a housewife. Do the number of partners someone have, would that affect your relationship? Are you possibly having a relationship with an individual? Absolutely. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because you know you have a lot of men out there who's had who've had a number of partners. But I'm gonna be honest so with you. I feel the same way as women. You could, but this that's me as an individual mm -hmm. and being, uh, you know, uh, like country foundation and, and and I'm a little old school. Yes, when you tell me, I don't want to know your number. Keep that to yourself. Even if I fall in love with you, do not tell me the number of men that you've had. Why is it a topic? Or you just had a past? Let's let's just agree. I agree. agree I don't want to know. I don't don't keep talking to me about it. Or know. so and so to do this because guess what? <laughs> what if I'm you heard through you. the streets? What if you heard through the grapevine that she's been with a lot of people? I'm she leaving. Necessarily have to <laughs> <laughs> You don't want to know, but you don't want to Because I want to keep wow. running into these people with you and you hugging them. Hi, hi. You know what I'm saying? You, that, me knowing how I am, that's going to be a problem. But there's a possibility that you will run into her past. Yeah, and that's fine, but not all the time. 
<laughs> not, not every other dude. Everywhere. Yeah. Every other dude. Yeah. Everywhere. Like even the pastor. Bro. <laughs> the pastor. The man that taught it. <laughs> All the time. The Comcast dude. Everybody I know you want a Showtime, but I ain't know you want to go about the change that. <laughs> you meet her in California. Y'all in Florida. Y'all in New York. <laughs> you want to hit the people. That part. Hey, Charlene, that part. What's up, Charlene? You still yeah. in the game? Nah, nah. What's dude, up, that's so Nike shop. Nike socks at the barbershop. Even he had it, man. Exactly. Exactly. Or oh, they looking at me, like, man, man, see the what? Man, man. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, 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 no. no, no. Absolutely not. Hey, man, with Charlene. Hey, Charlene, will you get back to New York? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You all in Utah giving us a hey. Yeah, hey. hey. You at Utah? Y'all together now? How y'all know each other? Mormons. Yes. No, no we not having that. Y'all need Come on, Charlene. Sorry. But then with it, if you if a girl, listen, think yeah, about it. Because women, they oh, like the man. number on the men. Because that means you know how do to do we? it. You got oh, my experience. God. Yeah, exactly. And then get, th- get this. Look at the love and hip hop. The same man yeah. has so many women. Yeah. Because all the women are competing to be with this one man, mm. whether it's from money, sex, or whatever. It's like, ooh, well, I've been with him so and so too. Or it's like it's weird. Like the more m- women that man has sex with, it makes him a god in a sense, mm. you know. Or, or you, you know, know especially what? if he got money. And kind of touched on that earlier. Hold That's up. a trap. Hold up, you right? Because I'm guilty. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, uh, and how are you, you, how you guilty? Tell me about that. I mean, just be you, you know tell. how I used to be because I'm gonna be clear to y'all. I ain't That's growing right. like this yeah. no more. Yeah. But I so used don't to be don't a hit man. you in the DMs, sir. I used to be cold blooded out there in them streets. But I'm saying Ooh. that's true because in hey. my situation, because in my situation that you guys know a little bit about, this person was known uh, to have a bunch of females, and they would talk about it. Mm-hmm. So we all smashed a homie. Yeah. What? Had sex with the same dude. Oh, really? Mm. Yeah. Why? Curious. Curious. Mm. Want to see what? So that, that actual behavior is real. Mm. So so the girls got a locker do. room too. Right. The so girls be talking too. Because yep. women talk know, more than men. Because you know how yeah. how you know how. I feel. But when you when you dysfunctional like that, you functioning through your body parts like that. That's a real behavior. Yeah. It's mm. actually a real thing. Absolutely. Mm. Women, wow. you cannot talk to your girlfriends. About what you doing in your bedroom that's with right. your men, mm. because yeah, come that for is you. real. Okay, they come okay, for and, and we can't do it either as fellas. Men, we can't do it. Okay. Your homie gonna look at you like, well, damn, she do all it's that. A, it's yeah. an actual yeah. real behavior. They be tapping on her shoulder. And that's true. I was like, I slid a little note. It was literally a note. I slid it to him. And I said, read it when you get in your car. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Shoot idea. your shot. Okay. That was that was yeah. that was yeah. sad. And, and, and a couple weeks went by, then I got a text message. <laughs> I said, here we go. <laughs> see, you had to find the right time. You didn't wow. See, I always had, I always had a cold though. I would never date my 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 buddy's ex or yeah, do something like no, that. No. But not that's everybody. I trait. found out though, not everybody has that cold. That's horrible. Not everybody has that, yeah. and so they waiting for you to get into the argument. They waiting for you to tell them about you know your conflict, your breakup, yep. what she doing, and so they just like, oh, okay, okay, okay. And they're ready, they ready, ready to they ready to go in the back end to be like, hey, how you doing? That's kind a of thing. So mm-hmm. yeah, no, no. yeah. That you, you can't you can't talk about you no, can't no, no, talk no. about yourself. If watching. you do that to me, it's gonna be a, a, a serious problem. I'm gonna make y'all life a living hell. Mm-hmm. You you gonna really do that to me? For real? No, yeah. no, 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 yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. supposed to be that's, loving that's me as my friend. That's real. No, no. I'm make your life. I told you about my issues and and wait a minute though, but you do have a lot of men that love to brag about how bad that girl is, man. She bad and she like this. But do men really realize what they're putting and setting up in another man's head? I don't think they do. Yeah, because men are also very visual. So as you're telling Absolutely. them the story about your bad girl and what she does, Why they may want to yeah, But uh-huh, you know what? They're envisioning that. And when they see her, that's what they're going to see. They're not going to see her as your girl. They're going to see all mm. the bedroom exploits yeah, yeah. that you just told mm. them about your girl. Now they fantasize Ooh, about they, your girl. About your girl. That's but see, hard. when you were saying that, I see a lot of guys, well, you know, Guys and girls go to the club. Mm-hmm. You may go to the club with your girl. Your girl got on something that got everybody looking. Yeah, right. every, yep. And yep. you okay with that? Mm-hmm. I mean, it's like ba- everything's well, out there. Because the man everything out I there. The I don't care if she on your, I don't care if she on your arm. Mm-hmm. She walking into a den full of thieves. Mm-hmm. And everybody, come everybody come looking on, at that. And, uh, and you can't fight everybody in the club. Sure you know, can't. Here's another twist on what you're saying. I've known a couple of guys who would send their woman steps in front of them just to see that. Mm. They got off on that. Wow. That's something now, else. I look at it like this. If you think my girl is bad, then that means I'm doing something right. 
Right. Just exactly. don't touch my girl. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, are they gonna touch now? But 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 the thing is, uh, yeah. they they they, they ain't that form of disrespect <laughs> though. If they looking at your girl that hard, even though you got her and you confident that's with like, her, but they looking at her that, that hard and they throwing their game and they shooting their shot, and that that is disrespectful. Completely. I, I don't. I don't. I mean, I don't even want to. You know, to Share even look at somebody like you know like that. Get away from me. Period. But I see a lot of guys though. They 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 may get off on the fact that hey yeah I got a girl she bad she bad but y'all been together three months. <laughs> so so ain't like ain't like a ain't like a lockdown like, yeah. 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 like, yeah. like, yeah. like, yeah. like you know what I'm saying she can slip be gone away. <laughs> slip away and most men that say that I think they're using their wife or girlfriend as a little trophy you know to yeah. impress other men or something but you don't know that you it's actually hurt yourself it's but, a game it's a game I mean because I think of it about this this photo this uh, album cover I saw saw back in the day Ice Ice T Ice T oh remember Ice T yeah. when he came out with that album cover and he put his girl on there yeah. I mean it was it, it was I don't know if they were I married. Am, um, uh, Darlene. No, no, no. What was that? It was another girl. You talking about the, the Filipino? The, the, the one he, yeah. the, the one was Darlene. Darlene. That's Darlene. Okay. She, well, she does uh, well, the Well, I don't know open, about first name, show. you know. Yeah. Oh, she still, I thought she, okay. No, no. It's the one he, was it? Yeah, that was Darlene. Darlene. Okay. It was Darlene. With the red, red bathing suit. Yeah. I was like, man, I wouldn't, Yeah. No, no, no. No. But look, he do Coco like that too until she cheated on him. Mm. Remember mm. his wife now, the the white girl. Yeah. She, uh, thick, thick she, but then she yeah. cheated on him, and he stayed. Yeah. So, so I mean, mm. stuff like that. I just wouldn't. I wouldn't want my girl, no matter how fine she is, to be out there just that, showing, e- showing everything. You're exploiting. Yeah, that's that's a room. There's a time and a place for Absolutely. that. Absolutely. But you have some women who Absolutely. don't mind being exploited, though. Yeah. They like that. They like being that that's chick true. that got the guy, and I got him, and and they love walking into the room. And letting every other chick know he's mine, mm-hmm. and don't you wish you had him? And dudes, don't you wish you had me? Yeah, yeah. And, so, yeah. and some women they take pleasure in that. That's why they wear the full-on lace bodysuit. Yeah, you know what I mean. Oh, Whatever. That's, that's why women are going to get their bodies done. Yeah, you know, dying for these it's killer the curves. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. <laughs> that's true. Uh huh. You know, j- just to be looked at. Yeah, you know, yeah. and that because you're not getting all that work done not to be looked at. You yeah. want to be looked at, yeah. and you want to be looked at a certain way. That's yeah, true. Uh, that's you, true. You want that Jessica Rabbit shape. So you don't believe when they say it's just for me then? Like, no. like when they, I'm doing this for me or whatever. They're doing it just for them, but they know they want to be seen too. Yeah, they want to be seen. Mm-hmm. I believe Cause, that. Because you're going under a whole lot of pain. Yeah. Mm-hmm. A lot yeah, of pain. Somebody to say, hey, baby, you look nice. Exactly. Oh, right. Because you, I know you, I know you want to look nice in your clothes. You I know you want to fit a certain way. <laughs> but you know when you put that fit dress on, you know you want somebody to say, girl, you looking yeah, good. You want that compliment. Outside of yourself. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Outside of you. You know you looking good, but you want somebody else to say that because you want that compliment that acknowledge, you yeah. know? I want to get back to the question that uh, you know yeah. Derek said that you know he couldn't well, far as far as dating somebody that had a had past for me I, I would I would think that if a person is is now no longer that promiscuous I wouldn't mind you if wouldn't. they if they were if they were now at a point where they wanted to settle down they were serious and there's no residue mm. then, then, you know I, I, I'm that okay with a that journey with that person yeah. I'm okay that, with that because so. because it's like we've all gone through and I don't want to look at them any differently than I look at myself because sure. it's like I've got my own stuff That's back right. there so if, if I'm at a point where I'm ready for a relationship and they're at ready I wouldn't really necessarily mind unless like I said there can't be no residue right. can't be no flashback can't be no oh I got all these males I'm still in contact with yeah. people that you had slept with because that's just too tempting yeah. you know that kind of thing so that's true. you know I, I can't I can't really hold them to a standard that I'm not really at right you know what I'm saying because a lot of women are just out there because they want a man but they've been hurt, and so they 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 out there. No, so they you know, sifting through they them, sifting to try to get through, them. trying okay. to find a relationship, true, and true. been dogged out or whatever, or not having and having issues with with daddy issues, man, and that, that that's creates true. problems that another man has to deal with. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, it's that's like a woman with kids, hard, hard you know. A There's a you know, uh, at one point I was like, yeah, I want a woman with kids. But what if you what if you love somebody and they just happen to have yeah. six kids? You fall in love, I, you can't help. I, you can't love with. That's true. I mean, you know. That's that's I for real. Especially, especially with the kids nowadays. You know, you walk in the girl house, the kids got Kool Aid stains in their t shirt, yeah. hot Cheeto dye on their fingers. Boogie, ah, you know, play tag? No. Ready to call your daddy? Go to sleep. 
<laughs> Don't you got school tomorrow? <laughs> 11 o'clock. Exactly. You ain't never lie. But Mama. you know, it's funny though when you have a lot of men that say they don't want a woman to have kids, but then you have a lot of women who take men with kids because true. a lot of them are coming with a bunch of kids. Yeah, that's true. true. They not just come with a bunch of kids. They come with about four, five baby mamas. Baby mamas, yeah. all that drama. So you have a whole lot of acting right. right. See, with that, if I was single, I would really have to be careful with that because I love kids so much. I would be the one to take over the man's child. Like, come on, be sp- out and get jealous if he was with his dad. You know what I'm saying? That I would have to work on that because I taught him how to play catch. Right, exactly. Especially if you ain't coming around. Like, no, this is my son now or my daughter. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. You had your chance. Yeah. <laughs> bye bye. Don't come over here no more. Act like we don't watch Paw Patrol together. <laughs> right, I just gave him a popsicle. <laughs> like that stain on my shirt ain't your Cheeto, Mark. <laughs> You know. <laughs> oh my god, y'all too much. You <laughs> <that crazy? laughs> so you all do agree that you can't turn the hoe into a housewife. She has to be ready. I don't I don't, I don't, think, I don't think you can turn her. I don't think you can turn her. If yeah, she if well, she if she content and she if she desperate enough to stay in that whole state, that then yeah. then you can't turn her. <laughs> and she has to be and she has to be to, Together, like she, she, like when we go to when we yeah. when we do what we do, it can't feel like I'm throwing a slim gym in the Sacramento River. Hey <laughs> <laughs> uh, <amen>. man, <laughs> um, rejuvenation. Um, I, I, rejuvenation. You know, it, it, you know it, it's it's so you get all into those type of conversations about that. I don't come I, hand in hand. That that that's I that's not with him. That's uh, with King Kong and God, so like I don't. This don't feel right. You I got know, it. Wow. <laughs> She okay. got to be together. I'm thinking, okay, what do you mean? Oh, oh, now I get it. Uh, wow. Oh, you know, God. wow. Okay. okay. Oh, my God. Right. But, you know, wow. But it, it goes back. It, it goes down that way. Well, but it goes Go ahead, back. But it, for, <laughs> it, goes, it, <laughs> it goes back to what I always say and what I've had to learn as a person doing things you have to really get to know a person you all the stuff everybody talking about takes time to get to know if yeah because yeah. if she is is like that or if he mm-hmm. is like that you, can, you don't need a minute you're gonna need a yeah, minute to yeah change. yeah oh yeah a lot of questions oh yeah questions. Really a lot. A lot of questions. you know a lot of history checking you mm-hmm. may not want to know number but you want to know how you functioning because you want to know if this person has healed from that behavior yeah like that's, it. that's it that's you it you gotta true. change her name mm-hmm. hoe into a housewife hoe and housewife don't work and so it goes gotta, with men too because if yeah. you have a lot of men that have that type of behavior yeah. And they may do good, you know, but then all of a sudden, you know, it's like they're having this resurrection. <laughs> yeah. And they yeah. still got to yeah. go back to a whole bunch that's, of other women. That's real. Because you though. have a lot of men that got real. a lot of hoish behavior. That's real. Yeah, absolutely. And, 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 and hoish behavior, I and mean, they just married somebody, mm-hmm. and now things are not, not working out, and they go back to their behavior. Yeah, of they course. regress. Mm-hmm. Of course. They weren't ready. Yeah. Of course. They was not ready. So, and, and, get so stressors, and get stressors that take them back there, too. Mm-hmm. It ain't necessarily mean they may not be ready. But some people have certain stressors that, that they can't handle because they haven't yep. been taught how to handle those stressors that's and just yeah. go that's right it. back off. And you will that. face them. Yeah, <laughs> you will face them. Especially so. if they're not handled. Yep. You, know, yeah. you didn't deal, you didn't with, deal the with them ahead of time. That thing sitting back there with his arms crossed waiting for you to get mad about something. Mm-hmm. Uh, so they can go back. You know you feel bad. Just go on, go over there. Go on. Mm. Go ahead, get mm. Well, if you want to chime in on the conversation, give us a call at 916-226-9226. Can you really turn a hoe into a housewife? Male wow. or female? Mm. We, will, we wow. would love to hear from you and also what is the best way to hit somebody up in the dms what's the best thing to say you know can you hit them up now fellas i'm not sure if you guys are you know are softies at heart but what if there was a flood and your your ex house flooded out and your child and your ex was flooded out and they had no family in the area and you are now married would you move your ex and your child into your home to make sure that your child had a safe place to stay because you're still friends with your ex no, no, I would take my work. child and I'll give you a hotel, like a little Motel 6 for $37 or something, but you're not coming up in there. Because what happened if, <laughs> if you know, what just here. happened if, like, you know, I'm mm-hmm. going to the kitchen, you know, and we end up, like, talking and then the wife walk out and then her feelings, she and her feelings, and, you know, I'm hugging you because you're crying and it looked just it's completely different than what it is. Like, how am I going to get out of that? You know, you so it's it. just like don't even don't even do it. You know, just 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 find another way, but take care of them. Absolutely, that's the mother who gave birth to your child. So find a way. But as far as coming and lay your head where I rest, it's just the baby can. But you, we gonna find you somewhere else. You know, a friend's house maybe, or you know, somebody. But not 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 to where it could get me in trouble. You know. Mm-hmm. 
Marie? Well, as far as two women of that nature, the new wife and the old wife being in the room together, women are full of shenanigans. Mm -hmm. And they can tend to do a power pull thing that you may or may not see. Mm -hmm. You you know what I'm saying? That's that's going on in that that moment. You know, the ex is like, because we got can. You know, and then the new wife is like, well, this is my, uh, uh, and you ain't going to come in here with the, no, no, no. It's this unspoken energy. It's an unspoken injury to have us. It's a dangerous ground. Yes, yeah, a dangerous ground. Even though ground. you yeah. may be cool, yeah. she may be the coolest yeah. person in the world. She may be cool with the wife, but in that space, that's good, Marie. Yeah, that that's can't real happen. Good. Yep. Interesting. I believe that. Ozzy, would you move your girl into your house? Hell no. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't. I, it's like it's like he said, because something might go wrong. She mm. might, you know, the new wifey might get the wrong idea about something. Look, I said, listen, my kid come stay with me. Maybe you can go stay with my mama for a couple. Of <laughs> <years>. <laughs> your mama on the spot like that. Let me sit it next to your mama. I'm like, boy, don't be seeing this girl over here in my house. Like, that's your first daughter-in-law. <laughs> that's true. Exactly. That's Help your grandbaby's mother. Don't no wife want to hear about? Well, you know, it just Help it her. happened because we had history. <laughs> don't nobody want to hear that. <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, everybody wants to say, well, you know, we got history. Don't nobody want to hear that. No, no who cares? Mm-hmm. No, your history, history is the is reason over. why y'all. Yeah, it's <laughs> over. Y'all ain't together. Uh, Joe? Hey, hey, that's the same thing. I would say I take care of my kid, but she had to go live with my mama, and she would probably like that too. <laughs> so that's just that's just what it is. Hey, 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 that's that what truth? it is. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know. You know. But if you want to chime in on this conversation, would you move your ex, even if it's a male, would you move your ex into your house just to make sure that they are safe from a flood, a storm? What would you do? Give us a call nine one six nine two. What is nine one six two two six nine two two six? That's interesting, it interesting. I, I'll donate to their their Facebook, you know, fundraiser, or whatever. Yeah. They put something out there. <laughs> drop a little something. They need a room. <laughs> okay, yeah, exactly. we all on the same page. My cousin, that. who get in the right those chicken y'all no. sit in there. <laughs> <Can't> <laughs> You know, Nana and them down the street. So yeah, you, you'll donate to the GoFundMe? I GoFundMe, yeah, I'll go ahead. And how long they going to stay? If it's a flood. <laughs> how long? Is this a flash flood month? or what is it? Okay. Or is, is it this what? a flash yeah, flood? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> how long y'all going to be here? <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, we can't do this. <laughs> Next thing, y'all going to ask them to get a room or something with, you know, uh, rent a room. Uh, no. Uh, mm-hmm. It's getting too close that to That one day's turned into three months. Three months. Yes, yeah, yep. this is not Will Smith and Jada yeah. and them. You know? <laughs> no, no. I know nobody understand the dynamics well, of that. Beats and Alicia Keys. Exactly. Yep. Oh, they just doing that to save her career anyway. Girl, be quiet. You know what I'm saying? You, well, you know, they just wrote that book, Swiss Beats and Alicia Keys and his ex-wife, Mashonda. Yeah, they act now. like they so lovey-dovey you know, now. for six years, they didn't get along, and now they are co-parenting. They have a book together, and it's, they said it's all wonderful. And if you want to see the actual video, you can actually check it out on my Hot Topics page. It's Hot Topics. Real Talk, No Chaser. The video was in there. They were on Good Morning America. And they're talking about how they're getting uh, okay. how they're, uh-huh, Yeah, they're talking about how they're getting along. And you know, it looked like everything is peaches and cream right now. But, but and they is have she to do living in the, the house with them? No, that I Okay, don't we'll know. see. Yeah. See what I'm saying? I like what Marie said. It's a little different. It's a little different. Yeah. I like what Marie said, the shenanigans that are played that you may or may not notice. Yeah. And so... That right That's there, because so, so some things we miss. Okay. As it men. goes on in the Always. Bible. That we miss. Always. Hagar and, and yep. Sarai. Oh, yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? When oh, Hagar yeah. got pregnant, yep. and, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? And all of a sudden her baby is mocking her. Yeah. Yep. W- women do that. Women yes, love to do. play power games, mm-hmm. mind trips. You know what I mean? We can play some Jedi mind tricks like nobody's mm-hmm. business. My grandma always said that a lot of women are sneaky, conniving, and devious. Mm-hmm. She they always are. said. And you find stuck, that too. Even when, true. even if mm. you go by, so like the grandparents' house and there's a situation that's going on and you have the step-parent, they're coming by and, and the new wife is there and you try to feel that energy that they try to create mm-hmm. because they were there first or if they had the first child. or mm-hmm. Women do that mm-hmm. and they do that a lot. Mm-hmm. You know, so you have to really be strong and confident mm-hmm. in who you are mm-hmm. in yeah. order to deal with them, them little head games. Yeah. But anyway, they got, head <laughs> yeah, they're, they're head games. Head they're head games. games. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I want to thank everybody for tuning in tonight. Thanks, thank God for the caller that called in tonight. Don't forget, we are here live every Thursday night at uh, 7 p.m. right here on Facebook. It's Hot Topics, Real Talk, No Chase. And make sure you go there, drop your hot topic in there. Make sure you join the group. And I just want to say thank you to my wonderful, wonderful <laughs> guest in studio tonight, Mr. Ozzy McNabb. Right. Yeah. I appreciate it. Thank y'all, y'all for having me. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's been, been fun. Check oh, him yeah. out. It's been a <laughs> blessing. Yeah, thank you. And also, my husband, Joe. Thank you. Right. Baby, 
Joe. 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 Welcome. Yeah, one awesome of the Mark. best lift riders I know. <laughs> <laughs> lift drivers I know. The best lift driver. Nobody drive lift like he did. Okay. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> cut <laughs> corners <laughs> like he did. All of us. Also, my all girl Marie, <laughs> and also the hair hustler, Mr. Yes. Derek Dennis. Make yes. sure everybody's on the lookout Dennis. for D's effects that should be Thank coming out. You. Hopefully, yes. time just yes. in time for the holidays. All right. Yes, get your beard straight. All that good old stuff. He is here to get you right. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> to get you right. Yeah. And again, do not forget. And also, if you want to see some free movies, make sure you guys go to my a Lady Charmaine page. It's LadyCharmaineLive.com. And make sure you sign up if you want to see the new movie, Nobody's Fool, starring Atika Sumter and also my girl, Miss Tiffany Haddish. We want to make sure you guys go there and get your free tickets. Make sure you sign up and join the wait list. And again, everybody, thank you guys so much for joining Hot Topics with Lady Charmaine and all of my dear friends. And we look forward to seeing you guys next week. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night.